Medical professionals all over the world are working tirelessly to treat coronavirus patients while also trying to stop its spread. Our Quentin Smith speaks with a doctor at Baptist Golden Triangle Hospital who's treated multiple patients just this week who tested positive for the virus. He joins us live with more on what doctors are doing to deal with the pandemic. Yeah, Joey, treating two patients in a span of three days shows just how quickly the coronavirus can spread. This outbreak is now shining a light on medical professionals as they try to treat patients and also avoid getting the disease themselves. Hey, I'm Dr. Scott. What's going on today? Seeing sick patients is nothing new for Dr. Clifton Scott, but what is new is the illness two of his recent patients have now contracted. I've been off for a week, I guess, when a lot of the corona stuff's been going on and came back on Monday and my first two patients that I saw were corona patients, corona positive patients. Scott says both were sick when they came in, showing obvious signs of COVID-19 symptoms. So they'd actually been tested previously in uh, the week prior, um, so they came back with shortness of breath, um, fever still, um, dehydration. It was, a very, it was a very much a flu-like picture if we didn't know that corona was there. Due to the rapid spread of the virus, Scott says he knew it was only a matter of time before a COVID-19 patient came into the hospital. Once the results came back, doctors immediately began treatment. One was requiring oxygen, a uh, fairly young guy, and I think that's one thing that people need to know is that, you know, we've talked about this being mainly a 60 to 80 age group range that we're dealing with, but these are some young people that we're dealing with as well that have uh, COVID. To protect themselves, doctors at Baptist are putting on gowns, gloves, and face masks whenever they're dealing with patients. The fear of, like, taking it home with you or, you know, passing it to somebody else, and we really don't know completely, you know, what droplet amount you have to get on you or so, I mean, there's a fear involved of seeing them, but I mean, we deal with it all the time. In light of the coronavirus outbreak and dealing with patients on a regular basis, Scott says he's isolating himself from his wife and kids at home. Outside of the hospital are signs that read, heroes work here to honor and thank the medical staff at Baptist for all of their hard work. Scott says he appreciates the kind gesture, but he also knows they can't take all of the credit. Any community that's self-quarantining and doing the isolation, and doing what we're asking them to do. I mean, they're all the heroes in this because it takes all of us to control this right now. Now, if anyone is experiencing any symptoms related to the coronavirus, you're encouraged not to show up here to Baptist, but instead call the hospital first. You'll go through a screening process and they'll let you know whether or not you need to come in. We'll have the number for you on our website at WCBI.com. But for now, reporting live in Columbus, Quentin Smith, WCBI News.